Happy Holidays, everybody, and welcome to a Christmas episode of Unboxed, Watched, and Reviewed. To me, the best thing about Christmas is the gift of giving, and the best kind of gift to me is a homemade gift. Today's movie is all about giving a homemade gift, and this movie was sent to me as a gift. This was given to me. It was given to me by the wonderful and hilarious Johnny Hellion. Now, Johnny Hellion is an artist who makes fucked up paintings, some 3D art, like sculptures of faces of like Divine's face. Johnny Hellion has a lot of interesting and fucked up shit. Check him out, add him to Facebook, tell him Obulus sent ya. Oh, okay. Oh! Inside was a DVD and a note. The note said, 2012. Obulus, here's something for your sweet tooth. It's time to bend over and give us a shitty grin. Johnny Hellion. So that was the note, so what's the movie? Uh, well, this movie is called, this is named by Johnny because it is frighteningly untitled. But uh, he gave it a name, and he calls it Hershey's Kisses. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, Hershey's Kisses. I'm wearing this shirt for a reason, people. So how did this DVD end up here at my house? Well, Johnny Hellion and I were talking, and he said, there was this real creepy motherfucker who gave me this big cardboard box filled up with all these VHS's that were wrapped up in grocery sacks. And he said, I watched them, and one was really fucked up. He explained to me a little bit about what the movie was. And I said, oh my god! I said, that sounds horrible. That sounds horrible. And I said, is there any way I could get you to send that to me? Maybe we could do a Netflix thing. He said, I'll gladly send it to you. No less than two days later, this shows up in the mail. Johnny Hellion, thank you from the bottom of my heart for sending me the most disgusting fucking thing I've ever seen. So, Merry Christmas, and let's get this show on the road, shall we? I'm dressed up in my Christmas gear, in the spirit of Christmas and St. Patrick's Day, we are going to watch Hershey's Kisses. I've never been this nervous to watch a movie. I don't know what kind of power this thing possesses. I'm nervous. I'm really nervous. I was so nervous that invisible people were asking me questions and giving me gifts. Yes, this is a Christmas shirt. Yes. Oh, I do! I got a present! Well, thank you, everybody! Thank you so much! What did you get me? Oh, thank you. It's the puke bucket! All wrapped up for this Christmas special! Knowing what I knew about this movie, I figured it would be best to get the puke bucket for this one. But don't worry, I wasn't drinking protein shakes that night. I wasn't drinking protein shakes tonight, baby. Uh oh, I was drinking Ensure. A chocolate kind. Ensure? What am I, 75? So I put the DVD in and up pops the menu and it has a title of its own. The menu calls it Brown. So how long is Brown? An hour and 17 minutes? Oh fuck me up the ass, Muda! Alright, let's start this. Play. Oh god. What? The fuck? There's not poop. There's people being stabbed. What in the fuck? Now he's ripping up organs and there's a screaming woman and they've ripped into her stomach? Am I watching snuff? Where's the shit? What? And there's just a close-up of the organs and there's blood coming out of her mouth and it's all in her... There's just a big old hole in the organs there and she's in this yellow dress. Now there's a naked guy covered in the organs and he's rubbing them all over himself. Then it cuts to this bald creep who looks like a goblin. He's the star of the shit movie. 
Hi you guys, I'm getting real nervous. Uh, this is a lot clearer than I thought it was gonna be. Oh God, oh! So after a quick intro with a bald goblin talking about smelling butts, we go to a masked man who is jacking off in front of a plate of shit. My friend Ryan is making a mixtape. On a promotional ad for it, he had a picture of this man on it. Now it's that weird footage again with the bald guy, but now there's a, like a Mexican guy there. It's close up, he's got a tattoo, and he's getting butt fucked in his poopy butt. Oh my no, oh no, he's moving around. He's putting his face on the ass. And listen to what that ass is doing while that guy's tongue and face is buried in the hole. Isn't that disgusting? I needed to get my Christmas present. Do you hear that? His mouth is on that. It's just a close-up of the guy's dick in the brown blossom. This movie jumps around a lot, from the bald guy to the guy from Ryan's mixtape. Well, here we go back to the mixtape guy. That guy. That's from Ryan's mixtape. I know it. All right, now this guy's butthole is right over a plate, and he's squeezing his shit out. Oh my god, it looks like one of my protein bars. Oh, now it got back to the guy who's eating that guy's shitty, shitty ass. He's got his mouth wide open. He's sticking his tongue out. Oh my god, the guy, there's like a shit hanging out of the guy. Oh my god, ah! He grabbed it, it's so big, he grabbed it with his fingers. Oh my god, he's pulling it out, it's really long. And he pulled it out and he's holding it now. It looks like a chicken leg. Oh my god, now he's spinning it around in his hands like it's a piece of corn and licking it. Oh no, he put it on his neck. Uh oh. Uh, well, uh, we missed the rug. I'll be back. I have to go change my pants real quick. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be back right after this. Steak, chicken, fish, nuts. All great sources of protein. But when you don't have a steak nearby, grab yourself one of these. What is it? It's a protein bar. A protein bar? Protein bar. It looks like a piece of shit. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. Your turd hole's gonna make me calm. Oh. This is just too much. We then see one of nature's masterpieces. His shit looks like um, like a piece of petrified wood. And now I come back to the uh, bald guy who's chewing something. Then in walks, there's a new character. So the bald guy lays down and this big black guy squats over his face and takes a big, chunky, golden shit into his mouth. It's gold! How could he do that? He's eating it! He's eating it! It's like hanging out of his mouth and he's chewing what he can! Protein bar! He's eating it all! No. Shit! Uh, oh my god! Uh, he's eating it like it's little candy bars. Uh, uh, he's, he's poking it out of his mouth! He swallowed it all. And now come the two most disgusting men on the planet. Are these new people? Many of you know that I cannot deal with no stuff or slime or anything from the nose, it makes me truly, truly sick, and I can't take it, it'll make me puke. So these two motherfuckers had to go and do what they did. Oh! oh. Put your tongue in my nose, suck it out! Uh. 
Slime. Slime, he said. So the slime suckers do some boot licking and some filthy talk. Then one of them takes down his pants and shows his filthy underwear. He shits right through the underwear. Oh. 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 He just took off his underwear and it looked like when you're changing a diaper and it's a real bad one and you take it off and there's just shit all over. That's what it looks like. And then he sat down on the guy's face with this one solid shit that has been smushed all over his butt. And now he's sitting on the guy's face and the shit looks like a uh, brown thick moss. He's posing. <laughs> He's picking up pieces off of his chest to put them back in. Put your teeth around his. I'm afraid my chest is gonna collapse. It was really starting to hurt with the dry heaving and the puking and not to mention it was going a mile a minute. I mean, I was so fucking nervous. Oh God, now he's got poop in his hands and he's saying, come get it, come get it, come get it, come get it. The other guy. <laughs> How could you do that? You didn't poop out of somebody's head. <laughs> Oh God. What is happening? Oh, I hope you're real proud of yourselves. We'll be right back. Thanks for joining me on this holiday special. Eggs, yogurt, pork tenderloin, all great sources of protein. But what do you do when you don't have a pork tenderloin laying around? You get yourself one of these. A protein bar. Come and get it. Come and get it. Come and eat it out of my hand. Protein bar. It looks like a piece of shit. Welcome back to the conclusion of Hershey's Kiss. We meet some more filthy motherfuckers, but this guy here really made me sick. He was fingering his dick hole. Oh. 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 Sticking my fucking finger in my dick hole, man. Did you see that? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I saw it. It was like... Then it goes to a big black muscular man jacking off. Then it shows his anus. And right as it's opening up, it... What? Scramble, scramble, scramble. It's all like black and staticky, like a VHS. Just, it's over. That was the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. That movie made the films of Otto Mule look like the films you'd see on 30 by 30 kid flicks. That was the hardest thing I've ever watched on this show. That was so hard to get through. I really wanted to shut it off, but I didn't. What do I give Brown or Hershey's Kisses on a scale of one to five? Well, I'd have to give it a zero. This truly was the sickest of the sick. He blew his nose into that man's mouth. It was just so scary and so sick. It was like an endurance competition, you know? I can't believe I finished it. Disgusting, infuriating, repulsive, and uh, it takes your breath away. It makes you real nervous. So, with that said, thanks for watching. Merry Christmas, everybody, and I'll see you next time.